Welcome back, blade lovers. A special one for you today, just in from White Mountain Knives. Here is the special edition Beglighter 2 button lock White Mountain Knives. And this might be the first you're seeing it. That would be nice if that was the case. I wanted to introduce everybody to it. And uh, we have a really beautiful button lock here. Incredibly smooth and drop shut. Let's get started by saying this is an Azo design. So I am told it is 154 cm. There is big letter 2. And there is your Azo. So that confirms it right there. And there is your 154 cm. A beautiful blade, a lightweight. And look at the handle material. It is a combo red and black carbon fiber. And it looks like that is the case through and through carbon fiber. We have a deep carry blackened clip. The clip is inset, as you can see, because you can see that inset on the left side as well. That means it's switchable. We have a blacked out button, a beautiful satin blade, nicely brushed, and a long run of file-like effective jimping. And the Beglighter 2 trademark clipped point utility is what I'm going to call that because without that clip it would be a straight back utility knife with a very nice belly and a very high all the way to the top flat grind there's your Kaiser logo really some nice eye candy for the money and I think this was 70 or 80 I'll leave the link so you can find out for yourself. Has a pretty sizable flipper tab. You can see that it's kind of on the wide side. It's got jimping on both sides. Two little divots of jimping there. So you can uh, light switch it open. And the jimping here forms a nice little platform for your finger for some choke up utility work. So if you wrap it right there, you're in pretty good shape. You can get a little closer. It is a medium sized knife. Let's get some specs on it. We have an overall length of seven and seven eighths. We have a blade length to the handle, we're going to call it just shy of 3.5, 3.4, and 3.25 on the cutting edge because we've got a pretty sizable sharpening choil there. Going to the micrometer, which is set in inches, so let's go to the handle thickness, 0.55. It's a nicely contoured 0.55, and blade thickness. 2.9, just under, we could even call it 3 millimeters. Let's try that again. 2.9. Okay, we're going to call it 2.9. And let's go with the scale. And fire it up. We have a, a very light 3.275, let's call that 3.3 ounces, 3.3 ounces. So medium size, lightweight knife, button lock. You can drop it open very easily with that button, close it with the button, and you can flip it. Just on bearings, perfect action. I would say the action's even slightly better than the Special Edition XL, which we happen to have on hand here from White Mountain. 
This one really took the knife community by storm because it is probably the largest button lock so far from Kaiser. And we have one of the original Beglider 2s. This one was purchased from Amazon. You can see same blade profile there. Although this is all blacked out and this has what they call the wood or wood grain carbon fiber on it. Very nice. Very classy with the brass pivots around. And uh, comparing it size wise we have really the exact same profile on each I would say maybe maybe the button locks just a tiny bit longer no I'd say it's the same but liner lock on one crazy drop shot ac shot action obviously with the XL same thing Again, let's take a look at the XL next to the Beckleiter 2. It is going to be a big boy. Let's get them out in the middle. Yeah, so. You want a big one, get this one, although I don't know when they're coming back at White Mountain and I don't know where else you can get them. So I'm glad I got me a copy or two. <laughs> um, this was, I think, a good move on the part of uh, White Mountain. This is unique in the world of button locks and Kaiser button locks and blade material and uh, everything. It's um, So far, this is the only hand of material that I've seen on this special. It is just feeling extremely light in the hand, and we do have weight relieving. There you go. Got some skeletonizing on both sides. As far as I can see. Quick comparison against um, a Benchmade here. Benchmade. Is it coming in longer? Just a tad, maybe about a half inch overall length. And uh, really about the same size blade. So just a bigger handle on that guy. And rat one. Let's give the big lighter a fair chance and we'll put it in the foreground. You can see how much more handle you have hanging over about an inch or inch and a quarter. And blade wise, yeah, we got a longer blade by about uh, yeah, about a half inch, let's call it. Outstanding little utility knife. And everybody's hot for button locks these days, so I gotta say, uh, that handle material really sets it apart as well. Just check that action out. Has an interesting kind of ring to it when you open it. Let's see if I can get it next to the mic. Excellent action. Can we feel it? Nope. It's a good strong, a good strong detent. You almost can't do it slow. It almost becomes more difficult. A lot of button locks are that way. I will say, and uh, credit to Jared Neves for finding this out, there was a problem on some people that had the XL version where it started getting stiff and locking up on them. Really, all you need to do is loosen a little bit these two screws right here and the pivot screw. And then very, you got to put a little bit of Loctite on the tips of these two screws and on the tip of the pivot screw. Start tightening them down very slightly. Go one, two, one, two, and then and then one, two, three. Just kind of go around until they're all snugged up equally. 
because the problem was, and there's no problem with this one, at least at this point in time, the problem was that if this scale is a little bit unbalanced on the liner, then it binds the button. It's as simple as that. That is a very defined hole, very exact hole for the button. So if this whole side of the handle here is skewed a little bit, tipped, then it's going to bind up that button. But um, I noticed on the cogents, VV cogent, there was some stick. There is no stick on this. I'm not saying this is better because of that, but no lock stick. They've done a great job. No lock stick. And again, you can open it all day long this way. No problem whatsoever. Or you can flip it. And that is the Kaiser Big Lighter 2 Button Lock Special Edition from White Mountain Knives. Kudos to uh, Justin up there at White Mountain. A great selection. And as um, far as I saw today, they're still there. So when this video posts, they should still be available. But they may go quickly. <laughs> anyway, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe. We'll be back with you real soon.